Previously on Making the Band. I've been afraid that you don't get this. I can't stand being so far away from you. I'm starting to understand why people say long distance relationships are hard. So the agreement is done. I signed it and it was a relief and it was like, okay, now the cut's gonna happen. I don't look where five guys win, two guys lose. I just look at five guys part of this group and two guys hopefully have other opportunities. Okay, I want to be announcing the five guys. Kaika, Jacob, Ashley, Eric, Trevor. everyone to be in this group. But I know Trevor put his heart out into everything he does, and I know he wanted it so bad. I couldn't be happier for the rest of the guys, and I think that the five guys that were chosen were the guys that were meant to be chosen, and I'm so happy to have known them. Better make you proud of it. I'm not kidding. I want to be proud of all of you. Be watching you. Pray for everyone you see all the time. All the time. Brian and Mike were bigger men than all of us because they probably wanted to cry at that moment and they didn't for us. They wanted us to enjoy our moment. It was so admirable of them to react that way. One, two, three, all the time. Hello? Hey. Hey. What's going on? What's going on with you? I didn't, I didn't make it. The hell? No. I'm sorry. Mom? You want to know who the five are? She was like, woo! I've never heard my mom scream that loud. I'm so glad that my mom was proud of me. It made me feel better than I've felt in a really long time. I really wished that my dad could have been there too, and he could have gotten on the phone and I could say, guess what, dad, I made it. Thank you so much, mom. So I'm coming back home. No, you're not. I, I am. Are you serious? Yeah, and I hope my room is intact. Oh, dude, I'm sorry. No, it's all right. It's all right. Those, there's a good group of guys that made it. They really are. Really? Yeah. How do you feel, Mike? Honestly? Yeah. I knew it. How? Uh, I read I read Lou. Like, when we were sitting in the living room Kim, before Kim came over. Yeah? I was, like, sitting there, and I was just looking at him, and, like, Lou's really good at, like, trying to hide stuff. But you could tell tonight, like, okay. I'd look at Jay, and he'd look away. And look at Mark, and he'd look away. And Brian, same thing, he looked away, and I was like, okay. And Nora's gone. It'll hurt for a long time, and I'll probably never get over the fact that I could have been in that group, but I'll be preoccupied. I hope I'll be preoccupied with school and work and modeling and so on. The times in my life where I've worked really hard at something and not achieved that goal, I certainly have walked away from those experiences disappointed, but having learned something from it. Are you all right? No, I'm fine, actually. Are you sure? I'm positive. I think that the biggest challenge that this group will have will probably be humility and not taking things for granted. We've all been incredibly blessed with a very unique opportunity. And I just hope that they don't lose focus of how hard it is to get to the point that they're at and how we kind of skipped a lot of steps that a lot of people struggle to go through. Knowing that I'm going to have to sit back and hear about all of it in magazines and newspapers and TV and not be a part of it, it crushes me.
If someone came up to me and offered me a million dollars in exchange for this experience, I wouldn't take it. Wouldn't take it.